back in October, it was October 12th when we found out that, uh, that, that they diagnosed her with stage four cancer, uh, rhabdomyosarcoma. And uh, they, the doctor told us that it, it looked it bad and they were gonna do all they could to save her. And we prayed and prayed about it and it was December, December 8th when we found, they, they had did a first scan and that's when we found out that the cancer was gone. Then, you know, even the, the NAS and all, the source of it, uh, the, first, the, NAS, the, the knot that was on the forearm, they found out, I mean, they, they, the doctor said he, had, he was gonna have to do surgery to remove that because that was the source and that's where it was coming from. And, you know, after you know, the following week, the knots began to go down and like I say, we, we, were still, we were still praying, we was giving it to God. And the knots had went down that following week. Then the week after that, the doctors examined her again and the knots were completely gone. She's still uh, going through radiation and she'll be, continue, she'll be done with that in another week. And she'll be following up with chemotherapy until the, the middle of October. We have a, a peace of mind in the midst of it all. And we have confidence that, that all things are well, that everything is okay and it's going to, it'll be over soon. It, it hasn't been no walking apart. It, it, we had our trying times, we had, you know, we, we faced our, our hardship and, you know, we faced different things. And, you know, it's part of life. But the difference is, as like I said, we, we, we trusted in the Lord, we trusted in God.